Okay, I'm back. And, uh... <laughs> Alright, so... I'm... I was kind of a little bit... I don't know what's the right word. Uh... Not fully satisfied with basically the bit of story that we had. Because... Yeah. We... It was basically all to do with the... Ah, damn it, I can't remember that race name again. The wolves anyway. Stay, saving their old the wolf guy. But... Yes. A prison break turned into prison squatting, right? Because they they stayed in the prison. Well, then again, it was because of that other guy who convinced him to say, "If you want to get your revenge, Jing Liu's coming, and then you can get revenge when she shows up." So he decided to stay. Stay put in the prison, but yeah, because of that, the inmates have to run the asylum right now. <laughs> uh, but yeah, enough about that. Just gotta wait six weeks more to find to see what happens in part two. I'm planning on quitting and, my job at the Sky Faring Commission. Yeah, in the meantime, I've got other stuff. Like, there's this side mission right here, which showed up after completing the story. So, yeah, I've got that to do. And I don't know if it's just going to be that. But, eh, we'll, we'll see how far this goes. Because I've got some other things scheduled today, and, uh, yeah. I want to do them, so in terms of this could be a little shorter than usual, just letting you know now. So, yeah. But hopefully when I come back, I will. Yeah, I gotta pick up that. I gotta make sure I do. <laughs> At least I know I am gonna start that tomorrow. <coughs> and then I can get my E6. Swordmaster March and technically with who I've set up I've got two E6s me and March <laughs> preservation and hunt oh that's gonna be terrifying in it so <laughs> yeah all right let's go let's get this side mission done Hopefully it doesn't, because it is, I just don't like that, the fact that it's so close that it doesn't trigger the other one as well. Or I just hope that the other one, you got to, alright, it's fine, it's nowhere near. Uh, so is, is this going to be a last lesson with these two? But then again, if it's not voiced, I ain't reading. All right. Now that you're in position, Miss March, let's get this lesson started. Okay, at least it, at least it is. It's basically because it's continuing from with within the story, the side mission. This this thing here is. Yeah, it has to be. Because you haven't finished the lessons yet. <laughs> I'm not good at acting all master-like. Since Grandpa asked me to teach you swordplay, I won't hold back any secrets. Oh, thank you so much, Masters! Oh, oh, wait. Does this mean our training is only officially starting right now? I thought you already had. After all... We need to watch you practice for a few days before we can figure out how talented you are, right? So, how'd I do, Master? You're definitely talented, Miss March. Oh, hey, here you are. Did you hear that? 
These two masters just called me a swordplay genius. <laughs> uh, way to go, March. <laughs> Just wait until I go back. Everyone's going to be so wowed by my new skills. Swordplay requires rigorous training. Before we start, Miss March, you need to find a clear reason to keep you motivated while you train. It doesn't have to be something huge, but it needs to be clear. Uh, the bubble tea, <laughs> right? <clears throat> In other words. Even though you didn't exactly choose to be our apprentice, you still need to take the initiative during this learning process. I once had the honor of learning swordplay from a master. She asked me why I started training at such a young age. Why I wielded a sword. So, for our first lesson, I'd like to ask you the same question. Hmm. Miss March, why do you wield your sword? For fun. Mm. For be interesting. Mm. Why do I wield my sword? I wield my sword to take down my enemies. I mean, what other reason is there? Eh, uh, there has to be more to that, March. I also questioned that sword master about why she uses her sword, and she said, to vanquish my enemies, nothing more. Miss March, you gave a similar response, which shows you've got potential. Well, okay, I thought there was going to actually be more to that. Not just simple straightforward like that. I will, I will this weapon so I can tear down my enemies. That's the same for all. Mm, true. The best way to take down your enemy is with a blaster gun. I heard a hero say something like that in an immersion. He also mentioned that sword training can push a person's physical abilities to their ultimate limit. Well, yeah, because you're in close range, not long range. So, you got to be more aware of your surroundings. Seems like you've seen your fair share of immersion this March. But if you want my opinion, if your goal is self-improvement, you'll feel just as accomplished even if you put down the sword and go back to your bow. <laughs> she do both. Oh, come on. Don't listen to his empty talk. Oh, now I'm curious to hear what Master Yun Lee has to say. <laughs> Let me ask you something, March. Do you have any specific goals for learning swordplay? Like achieving a certain ranking in the war dance, or maybe you want to defeat someone, like Yan Qing, or me. Who do I want to defeat? Her? Don Hung? Himeko? Or Mr. Yang? If you can't think of anyone specific, why not set a simpler goal? Like, how many opponents do you want to defeat at once with a sword? <laughs> I'll bite ten. <laughs> ten? Oops, uh, that just slipped out. It's actually another line from an immersion. <laughs> Stop saying lines. Yeah, I really like them. So what? <laughs> I think I figured out what's motivated March to learn swordplay. Hmm. C could it possibly be immersia about sword masters? Influence with so is basically monkey see, monkey do. Monkey sees it, monkey wants to do it. That's basically it, right? Hey, now that you mention it, <coughs> that actually makes sense. I'm super interested in Sienjo immersia and novels, even though I use a bow. Almost all the great heroes in those immersia use swords. So I want to be a sword master too. See? Monkey see, monkey do. <laughs> it does 
that's a matter. Everyone has their own preferences. Becoming a swordmaster who fights for justice and battles evil? <laughs> well, that's definitely a good reason to keep you motivated in swordplay training. <laughs> uh, now that you've both given your approval, I have another small request. I want to perform a tea ceremony to honor you as my masters. Remember, you'll need to tap the table a few times with your fingers. <laughs> uh, tea ceremony? Tap the table? Do we have to be so serious about accepting an apprentice for the first time? <laughs> hey, come on, let Match have it. Uh, please? That's how those heroes in the Immersia show their respect. No, oh, <laughs> just do it. Play along? <laughs> Let's just stop wasting time. Just treat us to some milk tea. And then we can start our real swordplay training, okay? Yeah! <laughs> uh, yeah! Alright, let's go! To the Sleepless Earl! <sighs> Wait, uh... Ah, so yeah, it is compl something completely different. That's good. I was, I, was kind of, I was kind of worried then, because, well, of how it initial just locked on. This LaFu stuff is too... <sighs> Except, nah, whatever. Hey, this is not how it's supposed to be, right? The Sienjo is known for its tea culture and hospitality, but you're not treating me like a guest at all. Seriously, am I not a guest? Seriously, Scott, why are you still here? <sighs> Dear guest. Stop! Don't call me a guest. You're not even treating me as one. I want my tea just right. Not too hot, not too cold. But the tea you serve was either freezing or scalding! Is this how you treat your guest on the Sienjo? How fantastic! Your tea tastes like slop, and you even have the nerve to charge me for it! Are you trying to scam honest folks? Uh, no, I think you already do that. And that name, the Sleepless Earl. It's so hard to remember. How about we give you a new plaque that says Sienjo Slop? It suits this place better, don't you think? Uh, shut up, dude. Stop! You've gone too far. Oh, who's that trying to be a hero? It's me. March 7th! Cause more trouble and I'll show you who your mommy is. <coughs> Wait, that sounded lame. Uh, hey, uh, say something for me. Hey, come on, you you got this, March. Keep going with it. <laughs> oh, that's right! I'm the sword champion! <laughs> Never heard of you. Now scurry back to wherever you crawled out from. Hey, don't don't be mean. Mr. Scott, I'm Yen Ching, a Cloud Knight Lieutenant. We've met before, and I suggest you stop causing trouble. Trouble? Ha! I'm just giving some feedback as a regular customer. The tea here is terrible, and now the Cloud Knights want to stop me from complaining about it? At this rate, who would want to ever come here for tea in the future? Uh, you're not complaining, you're threatening. A regular customer? You? Yeah, what else would I be? The Sienjo's prisoner? Uh, we can arrange that. Anyway, if you're trying to bully this young lady, You'd better watch out for the weapon in my hand. <laughs> huh? Oh, that really scares me. <laughs> Come on, you're not seriously trying to take my life with that piece of uh, scrap metal, are you? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Uh, scrap metal? Uh, this is my sword. I'm here to learn Sienjo swordplay. Swordplay? 
Oh, I get it now. It's just another kind of play, right? That explains why you're dressed like you're in a show. You're not even from the CN Joe, so why bother learning their sword play? If you're feeling unsafe, I can sell you an IPC mech. Oh, shut up. Ha! Huh, as if anyone wants your junkyard scrap mechs. <laughs> Oh, how marvelous! How about you show me, then? Okay. Well, guess it's time to show these bumpkins something serious. We can do a lot. <laughs> Just a reminder, IPC members. Street fighting on the Sienjo Lafu is prohibited. <laughs> Make any funny moves? And I'll smash that scrap metal. Hey, hey, relax. I know the rules. These are my subordinates. They got stuck here because of the transport ship incident, and they need to vent their frustration. In the end, it's all the Sienjo's fault. Well, I could overlook the terrible tea, but now that you're questioning my security, I can't let it slide. After all, I have a courier business to run. With so many clients watching, that just wouldn't look too good now, would it? Oh, now who's complaining? Instead of uh, wasting your life learning useless swordplay, why not invest in our civilian mechs? Hmm? You'll have your master kneeling and begging for mercy in no time. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Stop! Don't you dare insult Sienjo's swordplay like that! If you have the guts, I'll show your mechs what I can do! Good. Huh? A fight, you say? <laughs> now that you've thrown down the gauntlet March 7th, I feel I'm obliged to accept your challenge. Say whatever you want, but once you've seen what our mechs can do, you'll be practically begging us for them. Uh, you, yeah, you bet. Oh, come on. How could I say no to a bet? So... I can see you're no master yet, March, but I'll play fair. You go back and learn swordplay from your teachers here, and in 15 days, I'll come find you and challenge you with my mechs. Yeah. Only 15 days? All right, fine. And if you lose, you'll have to bark like a dog in public and shout, Sienjo swordplay is a total joke! <laughs> You'll stand at the entrance of our room alley and say it to everyone passing by. Oh, and if that's the case, just forget about your master and become my apprentice instead. I'll teach you how to pilot a mech. And if I win? <laughs> I'll become your apprentice? Uh... The apprentice is getting an apprentice early. Nah, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't like you. Yeah, don't like him. <laughs> okay, how about this? If I lose, I'll squeal like a pig in public and say, IPC mechs are a total joke. And I'll even print that on every mech on the transport ship. Deal? Oh, 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 oh. oh that's going to be bad for business. Hmm. Yeah, I think it has. The squealing isn't enough. You also need to apologize to the owner of the Sleepless Earl and take back what you said about Sienjo's swordplay. Fine, fine, I get it. But you've got to actually beat me with that little scrap of metal first. You all heard it, right? We'll meet again in 15 days. <laughs> Let's go. All right. The match is set. I'm still worried about the owner. Let's go check on her. Ugh. Those IPC guys just want to pick on an easy target so they can promote their scrap metal. <laughs> so typical. The Sienjo and IPC signed a trade agreement, 
so those IPC people won't dare to cause any trouble. But I need. Ah, dang it. Nah, eh, fine. Are you okay? Oh, yes. Thank you all for your timely help. The shop facing a bit of flat from visitors is a minor issue, but Miss March's decisions to challenge him is serious. Oh, I feel responsible as if the shop has inconvenienced you. Don't be. Uh, don't worry. I can't stand by and watch someone be bullied. I have to stand up against injustice, no matter what. Oh, not only do you speak like a hero from an immersia, but you also have a kind heart. Your charisma has completely won me over, Miss March. Aw, your first fan. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not quite a hero. Yet. Oh, I know you're here for the tea ceremony. Please come inside. Uh, thanks for the invitation, but right now, I just want to focus on practicing swordplay. Masters, let's <laughs> save the tea for later. Don't no more tea ceremony. Sure, the tea can wait for now. However, I have a question, Miss March. How confident are you about the bet you just made? Very. <laughs> Come on, how could I possibly lose? True, he is a weakling. <sighs> You're right. It, it seems she really hasn't considered anything. Yeah, she's just going with her emotions. I don't see any issue with it. Let March give it a shot. As long as she trains diligently, I believe she can easily deal with that hunk of IPC scrap metal. <laughs> as long as she trains diligently. I'm now filled with determination, Masters. I'll learn swordplay well and teach that guy a lesson. <laughs> You're my most trusted friend. You'll be my assistant teacher and make sure I learn swordplay properly. <laughs> Three teachers. <laughs> One apprentice. <laughs> Do I get paid? <laughs> hey, when have I ever treated you poorly? No, but I was just asking. <laughs> Masters, Miss Teaching Assistant, let's go back and start the training now. All right. No ter tea ceremony. Well, that can be done later. I'm planning but now. My job. Let's go and practice. I sure hope everything just works out fine. Oh. Well, not hopefully. We all know it's gonna. That IPC guy will show up in 15 days. I've got to become a sword master by then. And you will. Becoming a sword master in a mere 15 days is quite challenging. But we can't lose our momentum, Master Yun Li. Momentum alone will only keep you going for about three days. If you really want to stick with it, you need a solid plan. No worries. I found my professional teaching assistant to help me organize the lessons, so there won't be any problems. <laughs> Rest assured, Masters, if not in me, at least place your faith in her, my trusty sidekick. Yeah, <laughs> I'm a sidekick. Miss March is really passionate about learning swordplay, and now. She has a clear goal in mind. That's a good thing for her. There are many ways to defeat villains, but if you want to become a true hero, you have to focus on self-improvement. I hope you will always remember this, Miss March. Yeah, she always does. Got it. It's all etched into my memory. Uh, since you've got that in mind, it's time for me to set some targets for you. Please go ahead, Master Yun Li. We'll have three exams during these 15 days. If you pass our tests, 
Those pieces of IPC scrap won't stand a chance. <laughs> that would mean Yun Li is a terrible teacher. And if that's the case, I hope you won't force yourself to take on the challenge, Miss March. <laughs> hey! Hey! You are the terrible teacher here. Stop fighting, you two! I understand. In the Immersia, the disciple and the master share both honor and disgrace. If the apprentice fails, the master loses face, too. Well, there aren't that many customs on the Sienjo. I'm just worried about you getting hurt. But as long as you practice diligently and pass the tests, we'll feel confident about your duel. Now, let's go back to the first question I asked you. I'm sure you found a reason to wield your sword, right, Miss March? Absolutely! I wield my sword to become a hero! I want to fight for justice, punish the wicked, and make them quiver in fear and run away when they see me! And cry, Uncle! <laughs> then keep that fire burning, and learn with all your heart. You haven't said much, Miss Teaching Assistant. Any suggestions before we officially start training? Uh... Exactly! I prefer the cool, calm, and ruthless way of doing things. That's my kind of style. Really? <laughs> oh, that's enough chit-chat for now. But don't forget to keep an eye on my swordplay practice. Gotcha. Ah, pro progress. Okay, so... Ah, now I just got to accomplish all of this. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, I, I was just skipping. I have no idea what's going on. Boy, is this basically gonna increase our strength and all that? So, would she actually also keep this afterwards? Which will which will be good. Oh, I have to set something. All right, fine. Just just have that. Yeah. Hmm. All right, strength training. Uh, uh, basically, do one of each. <laughs> so Begin. So I'm just basically doing the same thing over and over and over. Ah, 
Gotcha. But with my stamina as is, or that count, it might be a bit difficult. Ah. Yeah. Okay, so there's one that increases it, and then, yeah. Let's do this. Some rest and relaxation. So I could speed up the session. But is this the only one that's going to take long? Or if it's always going to be the same thing afterwards, then yeah, it's kind of no point in always watching the same thing over and over and over. Yeah, it is. Alright, speed up. Picking. Uh. Ah. No, so oh, much. All right, more training. <laughs> Do that again. If you keep upping the training, I'm gonna start skipping class. Okay, uh, how do I? <sighs> Fine, I'll just do that then. close to that but gonna take some time getting all that I'll fight ten. yeah let, let's just go Sword and dexterity. Hmm? I learned so much today. Oh, well done, me. Hmm. Yeah, well done, you. Today, you'll face your first test. It's all about the basics. Okay. Oh, I know. It's a float like a butterfly, sing like a bee, right? <laughs> uh, that's boxing, but close enough, I guess. 
Grasping the basics is crucial to mastering swordplay, Miss March. Focus on wielding your sword properly, making your thrusts swift and strikes brisk. And parries should be fluid and nimble. Got it! See? Even March is getting bored of your rambling. Why don't you just put it in layman's terms? Uh, uh, but I'm actually not bored at all! Miss March is still a novice, so I'm giving her some tips on the basics to help her better understand them. Neglecting the basics will only make you vulnerable in a fight. Even for an extraordinary sword master like you, Yun Li. Uh, just focus on your teaching. Why bring me into this? He's helping you too. What? Didn't General Hoi An offer you any guidance? <laughs> Looks like your general hasn't told you to stop hopping around like a sparrow in a fight, huh? Miss March has been learning the basics of swordplay, and now it's time to put her knowledge to the test. Okay. Unsheath your swords, and show me what you've got, March. According to the schedule, there's a test today, right? I'm ready. <laughs> yeah. Wait, so... I can add some more stuff. Hmm. Another step closer to star crazing glass great sword. <laughs> uh. Okay, I just need that one. Hmm. So oh, yeah. All right, let's begin. Wait, am I going to do this on my own? Damn it! Oh, wait, no. It is our play. Good. <laughs> Azure Dragon, White Tiger, Less Card. What? The fight is over. Well, the fight was almost over. Azure Dragon, White Tiger, Less Card. <laughs> awesome! I didn't stop! <laughs> Ow. Azure Dragon, White Tiger, Less Card, Watch this! Woohoo! Wait. Huh. How was Marge healing herself? <laughs> no, I. This should, is that already built into her? Huh. Yeah! <laughs> Looks like I passed the test, right? So, one first test down. <laughs> yeah. Well done. You passed with flying colors. Great! Hey, uh, hurry up and congratulate me. Hey, I already did. True. Ah, oh, jeez, you sound just like those parents on the Sien show. Can't I get some praise now? When you complete everything. Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't have done it without my masters and you, Miss Teaching Assistant. So, if I were to take on that IPC guy now, what would you say are my chances? Eh, you'll probably still get beat. You already have a martial arts background and plenty of real combat experience. With swordplay guidance from me and Yun Li, if you were to challenge the IPC's security mechs now, I believe... You wouldn't stand a chance. Yeah, I kinda, I kinda gathered. Yun Li's... Right. No chance? Hey, are you trying to crush my confidence? 
I'm the kind of girl who performs better when I'm showered with praise, just so you know. Yes, but this is right now at this moment. to keep me motivated. Is it working now? <laughs> I thought teaching March was just something of a hobby. But now, actually seeing her progress gives me a sense of accomplishment. Aww. She's feeling the joys of being the teacher. <laughs> oh, really? So now you finally acknowledge her talent, Master Yunli? Don't worry, Miss March. I've been serious about teaching you from the start. Oh, don't try to cause a rift between us. <laughs> Every move and technique I taught March is straight from the Juming Art of Swordplay. Fifteen days of training is short, Miss March. Whether you pass or fail this test, I hope you'll continue with the basics. Because that's your best shot at winning. After every test, the General would take me to the Artisanship Commission for sword maintenance. Let's go, Miss March. Today, I'll follow the General's example, as a way of acknowledging your progress. <sighs> Thank you, Master Yenqing! Alright, so... <laughs> so, have you found any information about her? Have you been spying on her like I told you to? <laughs> yeah, that girl is one of the nameless on the Astral Express. Oh, she's no pushover. Don't you think this pet's a bit too risky? Yeah, it is. So what? Have you seen those big shots in the strategic investment department? Do they ever make safe bets? She thinks she can fool me by flying under the radar? You there! Get me the most powerful mech we've got! I want to crush her hopes and dreams! <laughs> uh, understood. Checking the inventory now. Now I'm curious to see what this 15-day crash course apprentice is really capable of. Don't worry. It's gonna be enough. <laughs> okay. Another four more days. Okay, so... Basically, to get my strength up. Yeah, go again. Am I supposed to have an assistant? Oh, assist. Hmm. Guess not right now, but... <sighs> Still think it would have been better. Right. Wonder what I'll run into today. I don't know. <laughs> ah. Um. Where, where, where was their voices? Still supposed to be our voices. Is it basically like the agenda thing all over again? Like when we had voices going through the that little thing in the was it the apocalyptic shadow or something like that? Which there was voices, and then when we got to him, there was nothing. I think it was the apocalyptic shadow. Could be wrong now. Eh. 
Yeah, I don't care, just hurry up. And they go. Oh, so now I get those. Ah, gotcha. Okay, so. Mm. Okay, if I do strength and then that, well, either way, I'm doing both. Oh, should I really take advantage of it and then do it? All swords and no play makes March a dull girl, you know. Yeah. Kind of gave it that. Yeah, I know, maybe I shouldn't, but... Eh. See what happens. So much strength training. Uh, how should I go about this? Eh... Uh... Yeah, I don't even know what... That one? Aww. I learned so much today! Yay! Well done, me! <laughs> ah! So it changes! Eh, that one. Okay, so... Over here... Oh, I can get that. But did I... Really just learn that? I guess I am pretty awesome after all. <laughs> okay, so next goal is that. Well, I can make sure I'm ready for everything else. Hmm. Yeah, I hope. Hmm. Okay, uh... Alright, so today is going to be... Wait, no. If that. you keep upping the training, I'm gonna start skipping class. Okay, dexterity is getting a boost. Wait. I was out. One's only getting a boost after I've. I've done that. Eh, fine. No, that'll do. Let's do this. Oh. <laughs> Extra strength. Extra dexterity. Wonder what I'll run into today. I don't know. <laughs> Said, why can't this be voiced? The other stuff in this is voiced. So yeah. Yeah, I'm just I'm just clicking any random stuff. Just speeding through it.
Ooh. Okay, uh... That would work on... that. Ah, yeah. Jeez, I'm exhausted. Uh, I think today should be a rest day. Hmm. Ah. Hmm. Okay, that does those two as well. That. Yeah. I'll fight Let's go for it. <laughs> yeah, just kind of hope I'm doing all this right. <laughs> what do you recommend? Eh. That one. <laughs> Sleepy March. <laughs> I'm ready. Oh, that's enough training for today. I need time to absorb everything. Time for your second test. I'll be your examiner this time, and I'll be testing your ability to defeat enemies with unconventional moves. Mm. Like what? Always said that everything can be a sword, and that there are. Endless possibilities for learning swordplay in this vast world. If you want to defeat your opponent, you'll need your own secret move. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of secret moves, I've prepared some flaming potent tea. Huh? Is that the flaming potent tea from Arumali? You got it! I saw this immersion where the hero drank the flaming potent tea and started stumbling and shaking all over the place. But then he managed to defeat his father's murderer with his drunken sword play. <laughs> Good example. Do you know how to do the drunken sword play? No. Uh, no. I figured I could just learn it by drinking flaming potent tea. No, that's not how it works. That's not how it works in real life, Miss March. Absolutely! I've learned a lot from my adventures. I've heard you've traveled a lot, Miss March. I'm excited to see how you incorporate your experiences into your swordplay moves. Your opponent this time is similar to the IPC mechs. Unsheath your swords and give it everything you've got. Okay. <laughs> According to the schedule, there's a test today, right? I'm ready. Yeah. Okay, so how was... Hmm. Hmm. Let's get in there. It's almost there. Yeah, I can I can't afford been able to get everything. But sadly I can't. Oh well. I'm gonna win regardless. <laughs> Go get it, March. Yeah. Oh, I get it. Yay. Yeah. Azure Dragon, White Tiger, Last Card. Watch this. <laughs> Keep going. You got this. Ah. You suck. Yeah. Lower 
Wait, when I hit him? Isn't my drone attacking the center one? Eh. Hoo-hoo! We got a big boost. So, if you lose that, yes, you progress probably, but you don't get the extra boost. Those moves were pretty unconventional, but the way you've blended them into your swordplay was impressive. It's like you've developed your own unique style, Miss March. Well, she is combining your two styles into into one, so yeah. So, I thought you were just wasting your time traveling around with Yun Lee's encouragement, but it seems like it's paid off. Well, well. Looks like someone's finally seeing sense. <laughs> Thank you both for your guidance. So, did I pass the test? <laughs> Without a doubt, you aced it. Awesome! Hey, Miss Teaching Assistant. Isn't it about time you showered me with praise? Oh, fine, fine. I won't be modest this time. My skills have improved by leaps and bounds. General Jing Yuan once told me that everyone has the potential to be my master. Not just Cloud Knight instructors, but also artists and outsiders. Well, yeah, you learn from meeting people. Even though they're not your official instruct master. Instructor, master, I've way. Actually, I was once convinced by Gwynaifen into swallowing a sword. That's definitely not something you learn from regular practice. So, what do you think your odds are, March? Uh, maybe around 30 or 40 percent? Well, I've gained a deeper understanding of swordplay. And I'm more aware of my own strengths now. So, no longer overconfident. By the way, in those Emersia stories, the sword masters always hide their true strength before a decisive battle. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. From the test, I can tell that you still need some time to master your swordplay. But, you did pretty well. Milk tea is on me today. <laughs> oh, yeah! Yay! The progress report on the Nameless Girl's sword training is complete. What should I do now, Specialist Scott? Go back and stalk her more! Need to learn everything. Huh? Are you being sarcastic or something? I mean, don't I have other important tasks to do? It feels like a bit of a waste of time to keep tabs on some random girl swordplay training. No, you have nothing better to do. Go watch that girl, watch her swordplay, and I want to win. But I can't lose. A waste of time? No! This is about safeguarding the reputation of the IPC and the honor of the Amber Lord. Are you saying that March 7th can actually take down an Arumaton from the Artisanship Commission with a sword? Come on, an Arumaton is no match for our state-of-the-art mechs. Go and strengthen our mechs even further. I refuse to believe that little sliver of metal can actually challenge our cutting-edge technology. <laughs> oh, oh, Scott. But the armor's already pretty thick. No, it's not enough. Reinforce it more. If I lose face, it's like losing face for the IPC and the Ember Lord. Can we afford to let that happen? Uh, if it's just you, yes, because no one likes you. <laughs> Understood. All right. Last day of training. 
All right, so dexterity. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Now nah, I'm gonna do that. Again, I can probably still say I'm doing it all wrong, but eh, who cares? Right? Hmm. What do you recommend? Hmm. So at least with this, I can help something else. Okay. Ah, I fell in the water. Yeah. Ah, uh, now okay. Now I just need that one to go up. Oh. I wonder what I'll run into today. All right. Let's see. And hopefully it's all right. Why can't this little bit be voiced? Ah, uh, Helio. Hey, Tail. <laughs> So, yeah. <clears throat> eh, just skipping through. Forget what they're saying. <coughs> so, that, eh, I'm not gonna meet Ho Ho anymore. Not fair. But she might still be around for some little boosting. Okay, that will increase my dexterity, but... Ah! Okay, the first one... All swords and no play makes March a dull girl, you know. Yeah, that'll do. Good. I gotta find time to try it out. Okay, so I'm gonna get these two moves. Next. I'm so far off from them. I'll fight ten. Wait. Oh. Wait. today I need time to absorb everything wait did I get an achievement for doing work while she's exhausted huh then all I was a thing Okay, that one. 
So... Got two forms there. And... That and... Uh. If you keep upping the training, I'm gonna start skipping class. No, you will not. Skip class. Let's do this. You need these lessons. Uh, how should I go about this? Uh. I don't know. This one I could do dexterity as well, but then again, eh, screw it. As I say, I just hope everything's right. Okay, apart from the last one, everything's in the 200s. Good. Wonder what I'll run into today. Okay, so basically I gotta work on strength and uh, that other one as well. Probably like keep them all like in a level ish. So is this going to be, I can, I do list for, for 15 days, then fight him, then I can come back and then redo, and then just do everything, to max everything out. Is that it? I would prefer that. But yeah, we'll, we'll see. Hmm. Okay, so that would increase that one. Hmm. Yeah, that that will do, right? Oh, another step closer to star crazing glass great sword. <laughs> yeah, now I've got to get everything to two hundred. Oh, two hundred and fifty. Well, some of them's almost there anyway. <laughs> All right, start training. <laughs> oh, was that an extra boost? I learned so much today. Oh, well done, me. Oh, look at that. Strength is way high. Before we start the test, there's something I need to tell you, Miss March. I've received a challenge letter from Scott. Wait, you received it? He's made thorough preparations, contacting the Realm Keeping Commission and getting approval for a martial arts exchange event. He even chose Arumali as the venue. Seems like he has some connections there. However, according to the rules, the person receiving the challenge letter has the right to decline the challenge. 
But declining would be like admitting defeat. Of course I'll accept it. But before that, you need to pass the final test. The graduation exam. Good. Hmm. I'm surprised, too. Oh, yeah, you are putting a lot of work. Well, it's not really graduation. It's just that the opponent for this exam is your master, Yen Qing. Oh. When General Jing Yuan was teaching me swordplay, he used to personally spar with me during crucial moments to assess my skills. After all, the master should be the one who is most aware of their student's strengths and weaknesses. But... Master Yen Ching... Facing you in a duel... Do I really stand a chance? Don't doubt yourself! How will we ever find out if you don't even try? True. Are you only scared because I'm your opponent, Miss March? Unsheath your swords and get ready, Miss March. The duel starts now! Yeah. <laughs> the final test. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> Don't. Come on, March 7th. You got this! Don't worry. We're gonna win this. But did I really just learn that? I guess I am pretty awesome after all. Yeah. Hmm. So what's the what what the colored flames? Hmm. Did it say anything about that? Which I'm probably well. How can I say forget? I I haven't been paying attention to anything. Just been clicking buttons as of, as they go. So yeah. All right. Bring it, master. Uh What just happened? White tiger. Less card. Watch this. Sword, heed me. <laughs> awesome. Uh. Now to deal with all your swords. You're all in on it. It it does kinda of suck. Azure Dragon, White Tiger, Less Card, Watch this! Well, not really. Punish evil! I've got this I've got this down. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I get it! Azure Dragon, White Tiger, Less Card, Watch this! And I the fight is over. <laughs> Not bad. You've made it this far, Miss March. You've passed the exam. Yeah. Oh. Yay! Congratulations. Hmm. Ha, I told you, compliments make me better. With your sword blade skills, you can effortlessly take down IPC Max, March. Yeah, I'm pretty confident too. But looking back, haven't you learned something more important than just sword play? The power of friendship. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I've not only learned sword play from masters, but I've also met a bunch of people. And gained a lot of insights from my experiences. Those experiences will nourish your sword skills. It's just like Master Yun Li said. Everything can be a sword. And there are endless possibilities for learning sword play in the vast world. That actually makes sense. Now, I'd love to hear your suggestions on how to defeat Scott. Uh, we slit his throat. <laughs> Oh, uh... Hmm... 
No, I think that's going back to a bow and arrow. A bow. No. Defeating Fevin Square. We challenged him as a sword master. With sword play. We're going to beat him with sword play. Yeah. I'll show Scott the power of the Sanjo sword play that he despises. Ha <laughs> ha. I remember Yen Ching once said, There are many ways to defeat villains. But if you want to become a true hero, you have to focus on self-improvement. Do you feel any closer to becoming the great hero you've always dreamed of? Ah, oh, yes, absolutely! The great hero within me is definitely up to the task. Haha! <laughs> oh! Why was that there? Huh. Grab this dummy. Ah. Probably that is so I can finish the stuff later. Right? So. Yeah. Alright, Scott. Bring it. Here I come. Dumplings and steamed buns. The there buns many are here. Here comes the day of reckoning. Hmm. Hey, you go apologize. Well, well. It isn't our hero, March 7th. Hmm. I'm not hiding or backing down. You challenged me, and I'm here to accept it. But I'm curious, why pick Arum Alley of all places? It's packed with tourists around, and it'd be bad if someone got hurt. True. Why Alrum Alley? Well, your buddy knows the answer to that. Uh... Ah, that's why. <laughs> I can't deny it. That fateful day left a mark on me. Don't worry, you're gonna suffer again. That's why I chose this place. I want to show all those people who laughed at me that I can stand on my own two feet again. <laughs> yeah, stand on your own two feet, then fall over and do the same. <laughs> They'll be like, what? That Scott is back again? What's he got up to this time? They'll see that I, Scott, who was once shamed in front of everyone, is back in our room alley to restore his honor. <laughs> yeah. They'll see that it won't be me squealing like a pig today, but you. Nah. Sorry, not gonna, not gonna happen. <laughs> True. Right person? No. I want to enact revenge on the entirety of Aurum Alley. But then, wait. Where does bullying the owner of the Sleepless Earl fit in with all of this? True. Ah! Oh, shut up! Look, I have my principles. I refuse to spend my life haunted by what happened in Aurum Alley. Do you think I'm just some sort of IPC small fry? Yes. I've been patient for so long, just waiting for the right moment. I don't care about proving my greatness. It's about showing everyone in our room alley that I will reclaim what was taken from me. Don't worry, you're never gonna reclaim it. who's only been learning swordplay for 15 days can defeat my invincible mechs? Dream on! 
Uh, there's nothing. There's no such thing as an invincible mech. Enough with the talk. Let's get down to business, boys. Huh. Once you bite the dust, you'll know what I'm capable of. <laughs> yeah. Bye. Okay, this is kind of Not a little unfair. Like. In it. But it does seem like it's working now. Wait, so every time I get hit, they get hit in turn. <laughs> Alright, it, it doesn't always work like that, but... Awesome. Go one march! Azure Dragon, White Tiger, less cards! Watch this! And now it's over. Ah! Why does it to be round two? You summon Oh, you're weaker this time around. Not very sportsmanlike. Okay, so that makes it easier. <laughs> Azure Dragon, White Tiger, less cards, watch this! Hi! <laughs> ah! You pathetic losers! How how did you all lose to that rookie? <laughs> uh. Hey, stop blaming others. Didn't you lose to me too? Yeah. So, does that mean I I have to... No way! This can't be happening! How could a tiny piece of scrap metal defeat the IPC's mechs? You guys must have cheated! This doesn't count. I demand a revenge! How? How do you say this doesn't count? You had a lot more people against March, and she still whooped your ass. Scrap metal, huh? The key to victory is never the weapon. It's the person wielding it. True. Yeah, let's not forget that. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> yeah, let's not forget our bet. <laughs> Enough. Fine. I've done this before anyway. I apologize. I want to apologize to the owner of the Sleepless Earl. It's my fault for causing trouble and making a scene on purpose. And the squealing. <laughs> Stay silent and hinting. Uh, you still got more to go. Hey, remember what you said? What about squealing like a pig? <laughs> Make him squeal! Make him squeal! Do it! Uh, hold on a sec. I want to get this on video. <laughs> oh, that's going to really ruin his reputation. It's happening all over again. All right. But before I squeal like a pig, there's something else I want to say. <laughs> Ciao. <laughs> Run. <laughs> IPC mechs are a total joke. Oink! 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 <laughs> oink! 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 Ah! <laughs> yeah, victory is mine. Uh Woohoo
So, I'm done. Woohoo! <sighs> but, can I still finish this training and max everything out? That's kind of what I want to know. Oh, there's more things to do. Ah. Gotcha. So basically doing these, I can max everything out, right? And... <laughs> All right, so <laughs> I'm going to be getting to Lee's. Well, it's going to take another four days, but eh, seems doable. Seems fun, especially if it's all going to be March. <laughs> so yeah, look forward to it for the next four days, <laughs> and then we can see her potential as a sword play wielder. In full bloom. <laughs> ah. So, yeah. Woohoo! So, yeah, this is basically like the Arum Alley, because we was there anyway. Like, helping out around, so this is just kind of like the same. So, yeah. Yeah, I'll rest a while, and then I'll be back, and... Mm. It's either that or this and that are the, are the exact same thing. Hmm. Master Yen Ching, Master Yun Li, you're teaching rocks. Oh, shame my body can't keep up with my brain. Yeah, I know. I just wanted to kind of just check and see what. So. <laughs> hmm. All right. So, yeah. Okay, so yeah, these... Well, actually, these are... Oh, the potential thing is over there, what I was doing. But... Oh, this kind of still... Uh, I don't know. But yeah... I'm going to be completing these, well, actually completing those, completes these on the side anyway, so, hmm, eh, wait, so I gotta get to five, do all five to get three. Uh, things for March. How, how do I get the other three? Or... or I'm a little confused. I thought doing this would help get to bring March up to full E6, right? But apparently not. But, yeah, let's just grab all these first before I, well, kind of call it quits for today. 
and yeah I'll be back again tomorrow because as I said I've got a few things to do so I would have liked to have done all this in one day but um, I'm gonna split into five it seems more reasonable that way right and plus that just makes them all short, simple, easy to digest and all that, so yeah. Alright. So wait, I need to first pick up all these. Ah, so I was getting zero motivation. Ha! At least I got that one. And somehow I still need that one. And that one is so hard. I am basically two off and I do not know which. Yeah. Doubles last two and I do not know which two I need. Uh, and basically one of them is the rare one for that one. And then there's some... Ah, whatever. Okay, and... Huh. I, did, I, I haven't realized I've done that many one-on-one -on -one fights. Huh. Go figure. So, yeah. March. Let's uh, finally put that on Some recognition for training my butt off. Oh, March's speed increases. Oh, <laughs> wait, what does what do all the others do? Uh, so what in layman terms, attack increases the standard stuff. Self-regeneration. Standard stuff. Oh, yeah. Apparently what I've seen so far is can get up to here, but I would still like the event if we could have got these two. Which technically should have, but... Yeah, whatever. Uh, still got to work on that. So, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, there was nothing new there. Hmm. Ah, uh, that actually goes to just me, so. Yeah. Alright. I'm good. I'm ready. So. Yeah. That is it. Yeah. <sighs> Hmm. Wait. Available? So... Oh yeah, it's her story. I still haven't done that yet. Which, yes, doing this first, then I'll get to that, so... Yeah. Uh. Alright. Enough stalling and wasting time. So, yeah. Okay, it's done. So, I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was fun. And, yeah. <laughs> okay. Wait, 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 wait.
reading stuff. Bye!